In today's video, we're working on a 2021 Golf 8 and we're adding the gas bonnet strut system. Hey guys, right, so this is a video in 2021 that I didn't think we'd have to be filming, but it seems we are because Volkswagen have taken away something pretty simple but has such a big effect on people. Um, this Golf 8 and the Golf 8 platform no longer comes with the pneumatic gas strut for the bonnet. It's the old school, lift it up, hook it into the bonnet and yeah. So James is just going to open the bonnet just to show you what we're currently faced with. Now this is a real, I didn't think we'd ever have to go put technology back into a vehicle, especially on a Golf 8, but it's, it's a pretty heavy bonnet. And the customer that we built this retrofit for um, couldn't lift up the bonnet. And it was, that, it was that simple. And it was too heavy for him. And he's asked us to come up with a solution using OEM, genuine Volkswagen parts, to give the pneumatic gas strut. So we're gonna be, um, we'll probably either remove this when we do it as a retrofit, or we'll just keep it there as, a, as an extra. But with the pneumatic gas strut, it does bring it down a little bit lower to about there, I think, which is the same height as the Golf 7.5. So what we're gonna do, is we're gonna get cracking. We're gonna show you what we've done. My next video is gonna be the final effect. There doesn't need to be an in-between video. The reason being is because we're hoping to sell this as a kit at some point, we're gonna film a little how-to video um, so that you can just buy the kit, follow the video, and do it all yourself. So stay tuned. Okie doke guys, right, so the new gas strut is all in the Golf 8, which like I said before, can't believe it's now not with it. So this is a really good video. So I'm holding our camera and I'm also gonna open the bonnet. It opens exactly the same way, but it's a good example to show you that why this is a much needed accessory. Give it a bit of a lift. And there you go. Gas strut all installed. We've gone onto the factory location down here. We've installed the new um, threaded nipple, which this gas strut goes into. Our factory stay is still here, but you can't use it because the, like the Golf 7.5, it's now the same height as what the Golf 7.5 was. So you can either leave it or you can remove it. It's down to you. So new gas strut is all in. And I'll just put it down nice and easy, lock it off. And then I'll just get James to quickly open it up just so you can get a, a full overview of how it goes up and down nicely. Okay, so James is just gonna flip the latch. And there you go. Give it a couple of seconds and it fully opens itself. And then again, effortlessly, you just pull it down and that's it. Nicely locked away. So Golf 8, we've given back the technology from the 7.5 and the 7s, which Still, as I keep saying, can't believe we're having to do this, but we filmed a how-to video, which we'll link in the description below, and also it will pop up at the end of this video so that you can watch it straight afterwards, and you can then buy the kit, which again will be the link in the description for you to purchase yourself, and jobs are good in. As always, thanks for watching. Hope you find it informative. Anything else like this that you need filming or doing or want us to look into, this video or this retrofit was suggested by one of our customers as an upgrade. So we've then done it as a video, how to do it, blah, blah, blah. Um, so yeah, you can be there like this as well. So don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button. And again, thanks for watching.